Yo, 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 EBD runs it, also known as Everything But Drama, back again with another Off The Grid video. This video I'm going to go over my loadouts, what I believe are the best setups, and what I believe could be the best setups in the future. So right now I have the Kite and the Sniper. Kite is one of my favorite SMGs in the game. Uh, the Osprey is my sec like my, my favorite sniper. I'd say the Kestrel's good, but the Osprey has more ammo, and you can fire more shots. Like, you can keep tinging them. You don't have to reload. It's, it's, it's nice. Uh, I should probably switch this out, because I like the Tap 9. Tap 9's pretty hot. It's meta in the, in the game right now. I have the Paralyzer Arm. I used Thumpers early on, and then I switched the Roadrunners. Uh, kinetic Shield. And that's it for that setup. So that's the kite and the sniper. I have the kite and the squall next. I'll switch this out because I got a tap nine now. Tap nine's the meta. Uh, paralyzer, thumpers, kinetic shield. And I'll show you what I have attached to these. Just give me one second. So I got a drum mag, increases my ammo up to 69 rounds. I have a kite compact flashlight. I don't have anything else, but as you can see, it increases the accuracy, so it's good to have that. I also have a muzzle, and this uh, increases the recoil control. This is the compensator uh, for the kite. I could use this uh, flash hider, but it's not as good. Um, and I have a reflex sight on it, but that's not, it's not the best. As you can see, there's better ones. But, the kite's pretty outfitted, it's pretty good, I recommend it. Ah, uh, the Achina! So I think I need a scope for this one, maybe? Nope, I got a 2.5 to 4, but I don't have any attachments on it, unfortunately, because I don't have anything unlocked. But if I was to guess, the light grip's better than the heavy grip, because the recoil control... If I had to put an, a mag on it, I'd put an extended. Um, we're going to switch this to the Tap 9, because Tap 9's meta. Uh, I have the Kite and the Mavinga. This is the Kite Nabua. I don't have the drum mag on that, though, unfortunately. You can't, you can't customize it. And that's it, unfortunately. I might switch that out though, we're going to switch that out for uh, the kite, epic base, there we go, that's the kite and the Mavinga. So next is vulture and kite, so this is a pretty decent setup, I like this setup. Uh, the vulture has a 2.5 scope to 4 times scope on it, it has a compensator for the vulture, it has a laser pointer, and an extended mag coming in at 42 rounds, bro. Let's get it. Um, next in the classes, we have the Takuma and the M4 Commodore. Recommend the M4 Commodore if you like assault rifles. The Takuma is a good SMG, so I recommend the Takuma as well. As you can see, my Takuma's got a drum mag on it. And we're gonna customize it actually, the appearance. I got that one, I got that one, and I got that one. So I'm just gonna go with that one. I don't think I have anything for the kite, unfortunately. Yeah, I don't got nothing for the kite. How about for the squall? Do I got anything for the squall? Nothing. The Achina looks nice though. But, that's my setups. Um, I prefer playing mostly Kite and Sniper. That's like the best setup I prefer. And then I go Kite and Squall for close quarters. It's good for like close quarters encounters, you know what I mean? Like, so if they're running up close, you can blast them with either one, the Kite or the Squall. Uh, the Kite and the Sniper, obviously if you're camping rooftops, take a Sniper. Typical, you know what I mean? But yeah, that's my setups. Those are good setups. Um, if you want to know other setups, I'll make another quick setup right now. Load up number seven. We're just going to click 
what I know is good. So the Partisan's dead, Vulture's dead, Commodore's dead, Mavinga's dead. I don't really like the Casper too much. I don't really like the Terracon too much, but I, I'll use these two if I if it comes down to it. But yeah, we're gonna go with the Takuma or the ah uh, the Woodpecker's good too. These three are my favorite. I don't really like the AZB, not too much because it's burst. Uh, shotgun, Flenser's good. Not as good as the Squall. People like to say the Flenser's better than the Squall, but Squall is just, you hold down the trigger on the controller and it's, uh, it, you're dead, bro. Simple as that. Uh, Boomslang's good, Hawk is good. And as you, well the Boomslang, is more for like mid range, long range distance. Throw a scope on it and you can actually hit pretty hard with it. Uh, the Hawk, pretty good. Marksman rifle, Proton's good. I don't have one unfortunately, but it is better. I prefer it over the Achina. But I'll, I'll use the Achina, you know what I mean? Because it's got two extra rounds in it. Sniper rifle, we talked about that already. As you can see, I prefer the one on the right. The Osprey, because it's so much better than the Kestrel. Look at that, look at that. People think the Kestrel is so much better, but it's actually not. Alright, if you guys enjoyed the video, smash that like button, smash that subscribe button. This is EBD Runs It from Everything But Drama Studios, and we're out, bro.